Hey guys, it's Abby with back to a new video on my channel. And before we get started, I would like to point out something and address the elephant in the room. Uh, this thing on my face. So, um, <laughs> I'm not wearing makeup at all because I am trying to get rid of a pimple on my face. That happens usually monthly. I really don't get pimples that often. Usually it happens like once a month and that's... There's, there's a reason why it happens that I'm not going to get into, but the, it happens once a month. And if you know, you know, that's the result of that. And I heard this thing on TikTok, if that you use like hydrochloride or hydro seal bandages, it will get off pretty well. So I'm going to be putting this on for like 24 hours, which comes in today's video. Today I am going to be doing eating childhood foods for 24 hours for around starting tomorrow, which is uh, Saturday, Saturday. Uh, so breakfast, lunch, and dinner for Saturday. And then breakfast again for Sunday, that will end the 24 hour time period. And throughout the whole period, I am going to be eating childhood foods that I specifically ate as a kid. It's great for nostalgia. It's kind of fun thing to do. And I'm only going to be eating foods from that time period that I've eaten as a child. So huh, this is going to cause a lot of junk food that I'm going to be eating. Oh my gosh, which I'm not complaining about, but it's actually quite interesting to see what I'm going to be eating for these 24 hours. So I'm going to be doing an Instacart kind of thing. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna actually be doing the Instacart and trying to um, buy the foods that I need for this challenge. And I am going to yeah, see how much that costs, honestly. Instacart's not cheap. So I feel like I'm gonna do it. And you guys are gonna be seeing me next morning after this. So I just wanna do an intro. This is today is Thursday. No, today's Friday. Tomorrow's gonna be Saturday and you guys are gonna be seeing me next clip just getting ready uh, for the day and fixing up some breakfast and at that time all the instacart stuff will be here so i will be showing you guys what i bought and everything what i'm going to be eating for today and also for sunday so let's get started with the video hey guys so i got everything i need for this challenge now it's still thursday and i decided that i want to show you guys what i got before i show you what i'm going to be eating for breakfast so let me show you a little bit of a haul of what i got so far so this is all from instacart by the way and again ignore the band-aid <laughs> um first we got the cosmic brownies my mom's gonna freak out when she sees this but yeah we got the cosmic brownies because i also i really like cosmic brownies as a kid and yeah we got that too um okay we got three boxes of craft dinner give a link in this video if you've had craft dinner as a child but we have three packs of these and I'm gonna be making this for dinner. So that's these Minute Maid apple juice boxes for the lunch portion of the challenge. And it's gonna be having for lunch with, it's this, okay, Lunchables. <laughs> it's Lunchables, I got Lunchables. One for my sister and one for me because she wants Lunchables. I don't think she cares about the rest of the challenge. She just wants the pizza Lunchables, but I got one for myself. Look, it wasn't supposed to have an Oreo in it. I never had Oreo Lunchables as a child. It's just that the one that I actually wanted was sold out. So they got, the cigar driver got this one instead. Um, honestly, I really don't care. I want, I just probably won't eat the Oreos. I probably will, but uh, I mean, I can't because it's not exactly, um, but I ate as a child, so I guess I really shouldn't. So I guess I would just be just eating the crackers, cheese, and, and ham, I guess. So that will be for the lunch portion. Hopefully I don't get hungry again after eating that because I can't eat anything else but childhood foods. Like literally, that's it. Uh, yeah, and then the last thing is my breakfast. I got this box of Cinnamon Toast Crunch because I loved Cinnamon Toast Crunch as a kid. Give a like on this video if you had Cinnamon Toast Crunch as a kid because I have. Again, I look really crusty right now, but like, I can't wear makeup and I still have this bandage on my head and I have to film today because I, it won't make any sense for me to film on set, like Saturday. Anyways, just deal with it. Um, so here is the breakfast uh, that I'm having. So, after this, you guys will be seeing me try the Cinnamon Toast Crunch breakfast. I haven't had it in a long time, honestly. Like a long, long time. Oh my gosh. Usually I don't eat cereal, but I'm eating it now. Um, and after this segment, you're gonna be seeing me have my childhood breakfast. Literally living my childhood dreams. Anyways, let's get started. Alright, good morning everyone. So it's the morning now, around like, it's like noon actually. I woke up a little late, just excuse that, and I am going to be eating breakfast now. Um, so it's Cinnamon Toast Crunch. That's what we're gonna be eating today. So I got everything I need. You can't really see the bowl, but I have the bowl here. Now we're gonna be opening this up and we're gonna be eating it. Yay, it smells like cinnamon. Oh. 
we can't see it, but the next time you see me, I'm gonna be sitting down in this chair that I have right here that you also can't see, and the angle's weird. Um, but we're gonna be eating this, so yeah. Okay, so now I'm gonna be eating my cereal. You guys, again, cannot see the bowl, but I have it right here. It's been a while since I had cinnamon toast crunch, but hopefully it will taste as good as it was back in Canada because I had a lot of Canadian foods when I was younger. So some might not be in America, but this is, and hopefully it tastes the same. Let me try. It's good. It's the same thing, basically. Nothing has changed. It's not different anymore. It's actually really good. Okay, I'm probably gonna need a lot of this. Um, again, I am lactose intolerant, so the milk I have is almond milk, vanilla flavored, because unsweetened isn't my favorite. So I'm gonna eat this, and then um, I guess I'm gonna talk about my day. I guess I'm gonna talk about my day then. So today, I filmed this on a Saturday. Today, I have to film a video for my main channel. You already know which one it is, so. <laughs> and I think after that, I'm usually just staying home today. I have a parcel to pick up, but I'm not sure if I'm gonna pick it up. And then I guess I could just watch like a movie. It's like raining outside today. It's not exactly a sunny day um, today, but yeah, I guess I could show some clips of me filming if that's okay. I, I don't know. I'll, ha I'll have to see. I'll really have to see because <laughs> it's gonna be a little awkward, but yes, I guess you guys can see the behind the scenes of me filming. Uh, but I'm gonna eat this up and then you can see a few clips of me doing some work and stuff so yeah guys yeah, so i'm back in my room i just finished eating breakfast i'm probably gonna eat lunch in around 2 p.m so there's like a gap between that because i'm actually really full right now so the next thing i'm gonna be eating are those lunchables so yeah but right now i think i'm going to be starting the video i don't know when i'm gonna post it honestly i don't feel as motivated as i should be today um because I have been posting daily like last week, so it's gonna give myself a few, uh, just a little bit of me time if that makes any sense. But I guess I'll just film something now. And I realized that um, I have to look at my notes from my phone and I'm filming with my phone, so you probably won't be seeing me film at all really. So I just realized that now. So sorry if there's no behind the scenes, but this basically I film like this. Like I'm on my chair right now, if you can see. And today I'm gonna to be filming, um, I think it's probably gonna be up after, like as soon as I post this video on my second channel, but I'm filming um, how to uh, demo farm with the, like the well balancing school and work. Hopefully that helps someone, but yeah, that's what, that's gonna be happening. I feel like after that video, I'm probably gonna not really post till the Valentine's Day update because there's, I have one no more ideas really at the moment. Hopefully I find something out, but we'll have to see. So yeah, I'm gonna do that, film the video, and then um, I think I'm just gonna be watching some movies, might show you some clips of what I'm watching and stuff like that. I think I might just watch, it's really a gloomy day today. So I think I might just watch either Disney or anime, who knows. Uh, but I'll be busy. <laughs> um, but yeah, um, I think, Whatever clip comes next, whatever clip. I'm not gonna plan it anymore. Um, let me just show you guys the next clip. Okay, bye. Okay, I don't know why, but I'm having a little bit of a stomach ache. Uh, I mean, I don't think there was milk in it because I'm literally having a stomach ache right now. I had to check the ingredients because it's, there's probably milk in it or something like that, something dairy. I don't even know. Because the milk I drank, wasn't there wasn't any dairy in it at all actually so i'm confused of what's going on but i have a stomach ache and that is hijacking my chances of filming right now because i want to rest and i feel ugh, you know like those intolerant things but yeah i just wanted to put that out there okay guys so i just finished filming and everything is exporting to my phone which i'm going to be editing probably tomorrow i really have no motivation to edit or post today it's a gloomy day i feel it and i think after this i'm just gonna honestly just chill watch some youtube and then i'm gonna come back when it's ready when my lunch is ready or I'm hungry again and I'm gonna eat something which is the Lunchables, I can't wait for that to happen, honestly, I'm excited. Um, but yeah, I've done everything, so now I wanna treat myself to a little bit of a rest. Okay, so sorry for the bad lighting, it is really gloomy today, so I'm trying to get like really close to the light right now, but I just got a Nerf gun. Yay, I bought a Nerf gun. Um, I'm gonna probably play with it a lot, it just helps me with boredom and stuff. My sister got one. But it's in purple, so it's coming in the mail actually pretty soon. We just got some more stuff from Amazon, thanks to my dad. And I got this. 
Woo. Basically, you get, okay, I have to like prop this down actually, hold on. So basically what you do is that you reload here. Oh, wow, okay. There's like a lot of nerve going stuff here, so you have to like reload. And then, oh, you just saw that spring. <laughs> I love Nerf guns, so I've been using this a lot when I'm bored, and yeah. <laughs> okay, after propping this off a million times later, we are here in my kitchen, and we're gonna try lunch now. So, the first thing I got, my sister, first thing I got is the Lunchables. So, I'm not gonna be in the Oreos, because that's not what I ate as a child. I just ate the cheese crackers and bologna. And I also got Minime apple juice boxes, which I had all the time as a child so we're gonna be opening this up and get one so i can have it for lunch i am actually really hungry right now my sister wants one too i think you want one okay she's like out of the camera <laughs> okay. i had a moose right here and it was like shaped as an apple if that makes any sense <laughs> just like how i remember it it tastes exactly like the canadian one. Oh my god we did this thing back in like as a child if you get the same color in these little tabs twice you win a prize never gotten the prize in fact i don't think anyone could have found the same color and no one got any prize it was some weird weird uh phenomenon that we kids back then had made up it was weird okay but anyways here is the lunchables Again, it did not look like this. It looked way different. I hopefully can find a picture of how it really looked like, but let me open it up so I'm tearing it back up. Okay. Okay, let me try it. Mmm, processed. Okay. So the cracker was tasted like, I remember tasting a bit more like Ritz. Like Ritz um, crackers. The bologna taste is processed as usual. <laughs> I'll be eating real meat. And then the cheese, um, Kind of overpowers the whole thing. Kind of overpowers the guy. Mm-hmm. I used to love Lunchables so much though. That was like the thing back then. Challenge is to eat all of it, so I guess I'm gonna be eating all of it then. <laughs> okay, so my Lunchables are done. Except for that one cheese, but anyways. They were actually not that bad. I thought I would not like it, but it's not that bad. Um yeah, I didn't have the Oreo because I didn't have Oreos with my Lunchables as a kid, but yeah, it's pretty good. Now I just wait till I'm hungry and I'll have my snack. Okay guys, so I feel like an hour has passed since I had those Lunchables and I'm ready for the next thing, which is snack. So I got the Cosmic Brownies like I showed you guys before and I'm gonna be eating them and trying them out. Um, I haven't had Cosmic Brownies in a long, long time. I feel like for two, three, four years, honestly, it's been a while. So hopefully it tastes just like the Canadian Cosmic Brownies because I loved Cosmic Brownies. I did not have them often, I have to say, but I loved looking at them. I wanted to have them. And as soon as I did, I loved them. So that was a childhood favorite for me. So I am going to try them. Okay, so I'm here and I'm going to be opening them up. Here it is. Awesome, awesome. Okay, so it comes with like two brownies like this. Here it is. Honestly, they're actually really good. <laughs> um, they're actually really good. I understand why I love this so much. It's actually, it's really good. Oh, wow. Yeah, very sweet though. Not very sweet, but it's a good amount of sweetness, honestly. It's not that sweet, but... Uh, for me, anyways, it might be safe for someone else, but it's actually really good. I'm gonna try this on. Try right, it on. I'm gonna eat this off camera, and then next thing you'll be seeing me, um, you see if I show you like a random clip or I'm eating dinner. So, guys, yeah, so the pasta is done. It's around like seven o'clock right now, and um, here is the craft dinner. Little dilemma I, I have here right now. So basically, you need milk or some sort of milk substitute to make this craft dinner. I used two boxes of these craft dinner meals. But the thing is, is that um, I have almond milk, but mine's vanilla almond milk. Like it says unsweetened and then put like vanilla. Um, even though it's unsweetened, you can still smell that vanilla thing. And I'm scared it's gonna make the pasta smell or taste really sweet. So I added some salt just to make it a little saltier. I don't know if that didn't anything we're gonna have to see when i actually try this out so yeah okay i got my dinner and we're gonna be eating it okay guys this is the last meal of my day on saturday and sunday you're gonna be seeing me eating my breakfast and that will end the 24 hour period but i got the 
goods right here and we're gonna be trying it out hopefully it tastes decent honestly because i mean it smells pretty good let's see if we can it tastes any better okay it does not taste like vanilla which is good um i actually added some spice which actually seemed to work the cheese is pretty cheesy um as you can see from the yellowness of my plate <laughs> i'm gonna eat all of this and then i'll be my dinner and you probably will see me in maybe like a random clip or tomorrow. I don't know, but you'll see me for probably the end of this video, which, wow, the 24 hours is ending really soon. Dang, okay. Well, see you guys next clip. So after dinner, me and my sister were watching some anime. It's Haikyuu, if you're wondering. It's really good. I definitely recommend it. And that was basically my uh, Saturday night. So good morning, everyone. It is the next day of the challenge, and it is the last meal of me eating my childhood foods for 24 hours. Nothing special. I'm just going to be eating some cinnamon toast crunch. Some cinnamon toast crunch right here. And I think after this, after I film this whole segment, I think I'm going to film the video and upload it today, hopefully. But that will be actually it for the video because you've already seen how I feel about the Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching my video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And I know it actually was really fun to do the challenge. So I decided to drink some sparkling water and some actual proper cook home cooked meals after this. But yeah guys, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. But yeah, bye bye guys!